being a girl i was not allowed to go anywhere from my house even to attend the marriage of my cousins i was not allowed aisha putti an advocate remembering her childhood in kerala much has changed since those times education and the initiatives of the national literacy mission are bringing about a sweeping revolution in society and in the lives of women lakamandal in uttaranchal women of the village work on a community owned grain thresher education is awakening the women of this mountainous region to a new consciousness indira sharma is a university student and a volunteer with the literacy mission main apne ghar se koi kharcha nahi mangti hu khud apna kharcha apne aap kar sakti hu balki kabhi kabhi zarurat padne par ghar walon ko bhi deti hu education has helped indira to stand on her own feet along with a friend prema an assistant prerak with the janshikshan and sansthan indira goes from house to house in the village the aim is to get the village women to come to the local literacy center at the literacy meeting the women are not just taught to read and write they also discuss issues vital to their lives Predicts tell them about money transactions and bank account operation. Literacy is changing the texture of daily life of the women. गांव में औरतें इकट्ठी हुई थी सब के जैसे ये जुआ वगैरह खेलते हैं और तो उन्हें फाड़ आई वो सारे ताश वगैरह सारे फाड़ दिए मीटिंग की गांव में तो काफी सुधार आ रहा है धीरे-धीरे बैंक में भी जाते तो अंगूठा लगाती थी सारे मैडम अब ज्यादा नहीं तो कम से कम अपना साइन तो मतलब कर ही सकती The women of these remote mountain villages can now look forward to better lives. An adult literacy class in Kesni village in Gujarat. These women, all below the poverty line, are being taught the alphabet by Shobhna Ben, a CEC prerak. Shobhna Ben is always willing to lend a helping hand. to pass on superior skills brought about by education the new literate women have gained enough confidence to start the chamunda self help group self help group formation allows them to enhance income from home based dairy business and shops A stone quarry at Mailadi near Kanyakumari in Tamil Nadu. Women work shoulder to shoulder with men breaking large stone blocks. A hard life, the work demanding and dangerous. A truckload of stones bring in rupees 200. into this hard life comes the benefit of education from being laborers these women have now collectively taken the management of the quarry into their own hands the self help groups formed by quarry workers operate their own bank accounts they help members through loans and profit sharing self help group meetings women think up new ways to improve the quality of their lives health is a crucial area that they focus on with the unity we can do anything the ladies can do anything these women have teamed up to manage the entire guest house operation of the state institute for rural development from humble beginnings making and selling spice powder and snacks 
these women today have reached a high level of management skills. Attention to detail is a key element of the work ethic of this self-help group. Mary is happy with the achievements of her group. She says that the literacy mission has played a major role in this success. We must be bold, strong, steady, one thing. The other thing is unity. Chittorgarh, Rajasthan. Water is a precious commodity in the deserts of Rajasthan. Hand pumps throughout the state need maintenance and repair. An opportunity for the spirited group of new literate women to become hand puff mechanics. The women proudly display their skills in a male dominated technical trade. Their success, a result of the CEC program of the literacy mission. <laughs> With newfound confidence, the same self-help group now organizes free eye camps in the region. Along with their family members, the women receive spectacles free of cost through a partnership program with local industries. From the pencil to the computer screen, the new literate women of Chittorgarh district are now planning to make a website of their own. Neelam studies in class 8 in Harsingpura in Haryana. Along with four of her friends, Neelam received the President's Bravery Award for stopping child marriage in their village. Inspired by street plays organized by the Zilla Shaksharta Samiti, the girls continue their efforts to stop social evils in their village. हाँ <laughs> Seema Sharma lives in Chakwara village near Jaipur in Rajasthan. A few years ago, her life would have been restricted to household work behind the four walls of her home. But literacy has radically extended Seema's boundaries. Today, Seema teaches the children of the village to read and write, but she also gained confidence to take on a new role women of a community could never have imagined earlier. हमने तो हमारे दिमाग से ही सोच लिया कि अच्छा लगो या मर लगो हमने तो सीखना तो है तो हमने बोला कि मैं भी ट्रैक्टर चलाना सीखूंगी तो महीने में हमने आधा घंटा रोज चलाना सीख गया तो धीरे-धीरे हमको चलाना आ गया सीमा इज नाउ कॉन्फिडेंट ऑफ हर एबिलिटीज एज अ ट्रैक्टर ड्राइवर हम हल जो के जानते हैं ट्रॉली जोड़ने जानते हैं उनमें तेल डालना कोई पाने पुली खुल जाते हैं उनको वापस जोड़ना ये काम जानते हैं सक्सेस नाउ स्पर्स सीमा ऑन टू बिल्ड ऑन हर एक्सपीरियंस अब तो हमने सोच रहे हैं कि इसी को और चलाना सीखते हैं तो हम दो हो जाएं फिर दो से चार हो जाएं फ्रॉम बीइंग एजेंट्स ऑफ कंटिन्यूटी women are fast becoming harbingers of change they can do everything they can manage they can uh, do, uh, become a politician and do so many works without corruption and they can uh, understand everything each and everything from the society more i think than men 